prolific character actor Harry Dean Stanton's drooping, weather-beaten appearance and superb acting talent have been his ticket to appearing in over 100 films and 50 TV episodes. Stanton was born in West Irvine, Kentucky, to Ursel Moberly, a cook, and Sheridan Harry Stanton, a barber and tobacco farmer. Stanton served as a cook in the U.S. Navy during World War II and was on board an LST during the Battle of Okinawa. He then returned to the University of Kentucky to appear in a production of Pygmalion, before heading out to California and honing his craft at the prestigious Pasadena Playhouse. Stanton then toured around the United States with a male choir, worked in children's theater, and then headed back to California. His first role on screen was in the tepid movie Tomahawk Trail, 1957, but he was quickly noticed and appeared regularly in minor roles as cowboys and soldiers through the late 1950s and early 1960s. His star continued to rise and he received better roles in which he could showcase his laid-back style, such as in Cool Hand Luke, 1967, Kelly's Heroes, 1970, Dillinger, 1973, The Godfather, Part 2, 1974, and in Alien, 1979. It was around this time that Stanton came to the attention of director Vim Wenders, who cast him in his finest role yet as Travis in The Moving Paris, Texas, 1984. Next indie director Alex Cox gave Stanton a role that really brought him to the forefront, in the quirky cult film Repo Man, 1984, Stanton was now heavily in demand and his unique look got him cast as everything from a suburban father in the mainstream Pretty in Pink, 1986, to a soft-hearted, but ill-fated, private investigator in Wild at Heart, 1990, and a crazy yet cunning scientist in Escape from New York, 1981. Apart from his film performances, Stanton is also an accomplished musician, and, the Harry Dean Stanton Band, and their unique spin on mariachi music have been playing together for well over a decade. They have toured internationally to rave reviews. Stanton became a cult figure of cinema and music and when Debbie Harry sang the lyric, I want to dance with Harry Dean, in her 1990s hit, I Want That Man, she was talking about him. As he moved into the time in his life when most other people would be calling it a day, Harry Dean Stanton has remained consistently active on screen, most recently appearing in films including Fear and Loathing in Las Vegas, 1998, The Green Mile, 1999, and The Man Who Cried, 2000. A true gem amongst character actors, and with an on-screen presence capable of adding that something extra to any production.